Brought to you by 1AAuto.com, your source for quality replacement parts and the best service on the internet. Hi, I'm Mike Green. I'm one of the owners of 1A Auto. I want to help you save time and money repairing and maintaining your vehicle. I'm going to use my 20 plus years experience restoring and repairing cars and trucks like this to show you the correct way to install parts from 1AAuto.com. The right parts installed correctly. That's going to save you time and money. Thank you and enjoy the video. In this video we're going to show you how to replace a side view mirror on this 2004 Dodge Ram. Uh, same for most 02 to 08. Um, this is in case your mirror got into a little altercation with maybe a garage pole or a garage door or a baseball or a, something like that. Tools you'll need are a T40 Torx driver, a Phillips screwdriver, a flat blade screwdriver, and a 10 millimeter wrench or a socket and ratchet. To remove your front door panel you're going to start by removing a T40 Torx screw and hold your handle on right there. Okay, and then you're going to remove four Phillips screws. One there, one up here, and then two down in the lower part of your door panel. There's my T40 Torx driver. Okay, we're going to speed it up here, take that T30 uh, screw out, and then your handle comes off. Um, and then I'm going to start with the Phillips screwdrivers, take those two off, and then uh, slightly take my jacket off so you can see my 1A Auto sweatshirt, and remove the two lower Phillips screws. Now use a regular screwdriver, carefully pry up on your switch plate here. Okay, and then pull it up, and both these connectors, they have a little button right here, press the button and work the connector to the switch, same thing here, button right there, okay, now you just lift the door panel up, over the lock here, To remove your mirror, or if your mirror is broken, what's remaining of your mirror, um, here is your harness lead. There's just a little button right on top. Push that down, unplug it. 10 millimeter wrench. And I'm going to use just because these ones are a little bit long. Okay, you see pretty much once you get them loose, they come right off by hand. Okay, so we'll just uh, fast forward through uh, removing those three 10 millimeter nuts. The mirror has a couple of tabs, just kind of pull it down. Okay, and here's just a quick close up. Use your screwdriver, press in on each tab on each side, and pull out the mirror at the same time. Push those tabs through and bring the mirror up and down. Okay, so here we have our new replacement from 1A Auto. Comes right out of the box. It's shipped folded. Hold it back into place. Okay. And you can see it's basically all the same as the original. It's going to mount the same. Same connector and everything. Okay, and we'll just fast forward through uh, putting those three 10 millimeter uh, nuts on and then tightening them up. You want to tighten them up uh, nice and firm, not too tight. You don't have to go crazy, um, but good and firm. Okay, 
if the everything works correctly. Take this off and put your door panel back on. There's this piece of insulation that fell off when we took our door panel off. Just press that back on. And before you put the door panel back on, you want to take this lock bezel and push the clips in. Okay, and pop it off. Just has little teeth there. Okay, it just has little teeth there that hold it in. So you just kind of push them with your finger over. Okay, we'll fast forward through just putting those four Phillips screws in and uh, tightening them up. Okay, our switch. Put the smaller connector in. And the larger connector. And feed the wires down in. Push it down in. Our door handle. I'm just going to put my extension and my bit in. Put it into place. You should be able to just pretty much start turning. It pretty much finds its own way. We hope this helps you out. Brought to you by www.1aauto.com, your source for quality replacement parts and the best service on the internet. Please feel free to call us toll free 888-844-3393. We're the company that's here for you on the internet and in person.